Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, I'm the co-founder of Shirt Companions, Daniel, and today I'm talking about how you should use your surf companion in the most effective way. Let's go. Welcome back guys, so great to see you. Really quick and easy, I'm talking about the surf companions and what is the most effective way to improve your surfing. Obviously, you need a good coffee, a pen, and your own surf companion. Link is in the description below. The surf companion itself, it will give you the surf knowledge you need here. For example, all about taking off in green waves or whoop, uh, in general, like the stance in surfing or whoop, even showing you board selection, the cutback, even the cutback in easy, understandable illustrations and keywords. If we give you the surf knowledge, there is still a big part missing. And the second part is because you're an individual, I'm an individual, your friends are individuals and everyone surfs different and everyone has different levels of surfing is we have to combine your individual surfing with the general surf knowledge, how it's being done. How do we do that? So for example, you go to your know, next surf trip and you struggle a bit with, you go to page 20, 21, and it's all about catching the green waves, the timing and when to glide and when to take off. That's a really crucial part in surfing because you want to have that awesome feeling taking off on a green wave. So for example, you go onto your surf trip and uh, you still struggle with the problem. Maybe you get a coach or you maybe you get a good friend who surfs better than you and you surf it. You, you read already in your surf campaign, oh, that's how it's been done. So you have to surf knowledge. But the second part is you as an individual surfer should know what you should work on. So for example, your really good surf coach will tell you, hey, look to the side during your gliding phase. So if you did the two extra, and you look to the sides gliding, so you don't want to forget it. What do you do? You take your pen and a sip of coffee. And you take your pen and you write down, look to the side, look to the side in your surf campaign. That's why we left a bit of space. Or for example, if you always fall, um, uh, maybe your coach, your friend, or your inner own experience, in your own experience you felt, I have to take off earlier. You write down, ah, don't forget, take off earlier and so on. You can use that in any subject. For example, later with turning the board, don't forget to grab only one side of the ray and so on. So our main purpose, that's why this book is so special, comparing to all the other surf books that are out there is, it will tell you what to do, but also gives you the space to put all the tips, you put it in, you won't forget it and you stay motivated. So grab your surf companions and work with it. Go to your next surf travel and think about, oh yeah, this is the most efficient way to surf paddling. Uh-huh. But I always forget that and that and that. Or your coach told you, ah, uh, have in mind blank, blank, blank. So this is the time where you have to fill it in which makes you automatically a better surfer. Why? Studies shows, instead of just reading it, uh -huh, that's how it's done, and then you try it in the water, it's, it's not as effective. If you really sit down, take your time, really think about, oh, I did that wrong, or maybe you have a video analysis with a good coach, and so on. And that you, you write it down in the surf companion, you stay motivated, and you will definitely improve your surfing. Thanks so much for watching this video. Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. If you like the content, what we do so far, by the way, check it out, here are some videos. Uh, subscribe and leave a comment below. I'm really interested what kind of surf knowledge you need. Can't wait to see you next time. Daniel from the Surf Companion.